Hey guys, from the TV9 studio at Oshkosh North, it's a sports show for September 29th. Coming up on the show today is some really fun stuff. Yeah. This is a reminder that students who are interested in joining the bowling club must turn in their registration forms and payment by Monday, October 3rd. See Mr. Muning in room 202. That's Mrs. Muning. <laughs> Are you 18 years old? Are you planning to vote? Do you need to get registered to do so? If you answered yes to these questions, you're in luck. Stop by the voter registration table inside door 7 during upperclassmen lunch tomorrow. Bring a valid driver's license or state ID. If you sign up to play in the Cops vs. Kids basketball game this Sunday, but need a ride, please check with Mr. Scott for a permission slip and write info. Oh, that's me. Um, help with writing college application essays today in the Writing and Reading Center before and after school in the Innovation Lab on the second floor. Breakfast. That's what's for dinner at AMP today after school. Like always, it's room 117. Send the rents to school. They can learn how to handle your anxiety better from 6 to 7 p.m. in room 117. Also, they can help with infinite campus tomorrow beginning at 3.30 in the computer lab. Last chance to win a $50 gift card. Design a log for the new Oshkosh North Writing slash Reading Center. Pick up a flyer giving additional information for the contest in the Media Center, AMP, or in the Student Service Office. Submissions are due this Friday by the end of the day. What's up, Oshkosh North, to the super fans again. Um, we are here to talk about after the Northwest game, there's a fifth quarter party at the Boys and Girls Club. Um, it runs till midnight. There will be laser tag, bubble soccer. Um, there will be a dance, so a DJ, things like that. Uh, the, the, there will be a bus after the game to transport you to the Boys and Girls Club if you don't have a ride, but you will need to sign a permission slip. You can pick that up in the office. Uh, if you have any questions, you can talk to Ms. Goth here about it, but yeah, we have a fifth quarter party after the North and West game. Uh, feel free to come out to the Northwest game and then head over to the Boys and Girls Club for a fifth quarter party. Good morning, Oshkosh North. I'm Tegan Patton. I'm Zach Quinn. And I'm Adam McAvoy. We're here to talk to you about Boys Swim Team. Morning practices will start October 18th from 6.45 to 7.45. Um, the season will start on November 15th and we want anybody to come out. If you have any interest, come to morning practices, try it out. If you don't like it, you don't need to go out for swim team, but if you do like it, you can go out. And it doesn't matter if you're the next Michael Phelps or if you're kind of drowning. Mr. Leader will make sure you don't drown. Be there or be square. Yeah. Join us for yoga today after school in room 117. It's all about belonging. Check out Adult Team 101 after school room 119. Blah, 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 blah. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Did you know Wisconsin is considered a swing state this upcoming election. A swing state means that both parties have similar levels of support in that particular state. Not only is Wisconsin a swing state, but Winnebago County is considered a swing county within Wisconsin. This means that votes from Winnebago County will be significant in determining which candidate wins Wisconsin's vote. You may think your vote doesn't matter, but it really does. We encourage everyone to get out and vote. Oshkosh North will be hosting voter registration for new voters and any staff that have moved addresses before the last time they voted on September 30th, that's this Friday, by door 7 from 11.30, from 7.30 to 11.30. You must have turned 18 on or before November 8th and bring something that proves you live at your current address. For example, your driver's license, a paycheck, or your employer ID would be acceptable. Take advantage of this registration opportunity going on at your school. That way you don't have to wait in line for hours on November 8th. 
Thanks everyone, and see you at the poll, Spartans. Hi, I'm Trevor Beam with the Oshkosh North TV9 studio. You may have seen our latest hit video, The Boy Who Could Disappear. If you'd like to see more videos of that kind, then follow us on Instagram at OVPD. Yes, take out your phones right now. Getting something out of the locker. Okay, no, 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 no. You don't get to do that during the regular time. Why? It's gym class now. Yeah, I've... it's in the locker room. That's... Your gym class is, is not right now. Yeah, it's not. So, goodbye. Bad boys, bad boys, what you gonna do? What you gonna do when they come for you? Bad boys, bad boys, what you gonna do? What you gonna do when they come for you? No, 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 young man. Can't you read the sign? It says, do not pound on doors. Use the main entrance. Wait a minute there, Mabel. The locker room is not to be used during the lunchtime. Nor will it be accessed during Phi Ed class. And where did I go wrong? I lost alone. Hey, hey, you kids! You can't walk across here. We just had the floor refinished. You need to walk along the walkway. On the black walkway, please. Yes, tighten it up, tighten it up, tighten it up. The black walkway. There you go. There you go. Much better. There we go. You again? All locker rooms are closed during lunch. And the doors will open at 8.05 in the morning. Do not pound on the doors!